Welcome to a demonstration showing how to add a Google Gadget, a motion chart, to a Google spreadsheet. I've already selected the data set and I've already selected the range of data I would like in my motion chart. To add it, simply click on Insert and then Gadget. Under Motion Chart, click Add to Spreadsheet. I'm going to title this Plant Height Over Time. Click Apply and Close and the motion chart will be embedded onto the spreadsheet. There's a lot of data here, so I'd really like to look at it on its own sheet. Pull down the menu and click Move to Own Sheet. This will open it up and give me more of an opportunity to look at the data. First, I'll set the y-axis to the height of the plants. Then I will set the x-axis to the time that the plants have had to grow. I'd also like to take a look at the different crops. In this case, blue is for beans, green is for corn, and yellow for tomatoes. And I would like to only look at data for a couple of different students, Abiola and Becca and Camelia. I'm going to click on Run, and this will show us the growth in their plants height over time. We can see here that the corn, the green, is really taking off. The beans are growing second in height, and the tomatoes are third. We could also take a look at the numbers of leaves. This will change each of the circles to indicate the number of leaves. For example, on January 21st, these beans had fewer leaves because the circle is smaller. As a matter of fact, they had six leaves. And the corn had nine, and the fastest growing had 11. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you enjoy using this tool with your students.